Hello, baseball fans, and welcome to the Ottoman Summit Rec Baseball Complex, home to On Deck Baseball. Tonight's game features the visiting McCutcheon Mavericks and your very own On Deck Walruses. On Deck Baseball has dedicated tonight's game as a teacher appreciation game to honor and recognize our great teachers, educators, and administration in our local schools. Tonight is a night where we would like to give a simple thank you to all the educators in attendance and from afar. Thank you for devoting your time and efforts in caring for our youth. Thank you for being role models, caring, sharing, loving, hugging, building confidence, shaping minds, being a good listener, being a disciplinarian, being a coach, creating positivity, giving a shoulder to cry on, and being therapists, psychologists, nurses, and caseworkers at all times. You all play an integral part in making the world a better place. At this time, we would like to recognize some teachers on the field who were selected by our players to join us tonight. First up, we have Christine Wise from Mintani Elementary, who was selected by Logan Brigham to be here tonight. <laughs> Mrs. Wise has 10 years of teaching experience and currently teaches third grade. Her favorite motivation in teaching is that she loves watching the students get excited to learn new things. The students' excitement never gets boring and always energizes her. She loves pushing them to do big things, set goals, and help coach them along the way. Watching their confidence grow and celebrating those goals is a huge part of growing their mindset for learning life. Some awards that Mrs. Wise has received, she received the 2022 Mintani Teacher of the Year Award and the 2023 Lafayette Aviators Teacher of the Game. Her favorite things to do in the summer are work in her flower beds, lay by the pool, read, plan things for next school year, watch her son's sporting events, get together with friends, and help her 4-H club members at the fair. Logan said he chose Mrs. Wise because she's very funny and nice and she likes, or he likes when she roasts her students. She lets us play games every morning except Mondays and she got me a McDonald's one day. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Wise. Next, we have Lauren Borden from Delphi Elementary who is selected by Hudson Wagner to be here tonight. Mrs. Borden has five years of teaching experience and currently teaches third grade at Delphi. Her favorite thing in teaching is coming to work every day to see her kids and watching them grow throughout the school year. Recently, Mrs. Borden has accepted a new position as the English language learner teacher of record. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is to relax and spend time with family. Hudson said he chose Mrs. Borden because she's a patient and caring teacher. She helped me improve a lot in reading and gave me the confidence to do so. She encouraged me to believe in myself and I always look forward to going to her class each and every day. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Borden. Next, we have Amanda Kanoy from Amelia Earhart Elementary, who was selected by Jeter Doughty to be here tonight. Mrs. Kanoy has 19 years of teaching experience and currently teaches third grade. Her favorite motivation in teaching is making connections with students and using those connections to help maintain positive relationships throughout the year. Mrs. Kanoy received the 2022 Extra Yard Teacher recognized by Purdue University. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is to spend time with her three daughters and her husband. Jeter said he chose Mrs. Kanoy because she was a great teacher. She made learning fun and he loved the pizza parties when we reached our goals. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Kanoy. Next we have Mila Swank from Busy Day Preschool who was selected by Beckett Trotsky to be here tonight. Miss Mila has 10 years of teaching experience and currently teaches pre-kindergarten. Her favorite motivation is of course the kiddos. Their joy is contagious and she cannot think of a better sound than the laughter of a child. She loves watching each child grow in their ability and confidence throughout the year. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is anything with her family and she really enjoys exploring state and national parks. Beckett said, choosing Miss Mila was an easy decision. Our family was lucky enough to have two kids go through busy day with Mila. Her preschool focuses on creativity and hands-on learning and she spends countless hours collecting household items to use for crafts. She even brought in the live turkey at Thanksgiving time. Hatches baby chicks and takes them on a trip through Paris with mustaches to match. Some of her favorite memories of Beckett come from those preschool years, including his famous 911 dance on stage and the yearly gobble gobble that we sing at Thanksgiving. In Beckett's words, she's nice, she has sons who plays baseball, she did fun crafts, and she made school fun. We love Mrs. Mila. Put your hands together for Miss Mila. Up next, we have Jamie Whitaker from Frontier Elementary, who is selected by Simon Leno to be here tonight. <laughs> Mrs. Whitaker has six years of teaching experience and currently teaches third grade. Her favorite thing and motivation in teaching is working with the leaders of tomorrow. 
and that there's nothing more rewarding than seeing a child become even more the person they're meant to be and knowing that she has been an impactful part of their story. Yeah. Mrs. Whitaker has received the PTO Teacher of the Month before. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is to spend time on the lake enjoying the sun on sunshine with her family and friends. Simon said he chose Mrs. Whitaker because she's a very caring teacher. She bought my lunch one day to celebrate my sister being born. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Whitaker. Next, we have Sally Lauk from Amelia Earhart Elementary, who was selected by Easton Myers to be here tonight. Mrs. Lauk has 15 years of teaching experience and currently teaches in the second grade. Her favorite thing and motivation in teaching is that teaching is such a rewarding job because you know that each and every day you're making a difference in a child's life. Her favorite part of teaching is building connections and relationships with the students and watching those connections grow among the classmates. Mrs. Lauk is a Golden Apple recipient award winner as well. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is to spend extra time with her family. Easton said he chose Mrs. Lauk because she always did nice things in the second grade. She always made me feel happy. She's kind, caring, and she gave us lots of treats like donuts and candy. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Lau. Next, we have Leah Person from Woodland Elementary who was selected by Jack McMillan to be here tonight. Mrs. Person has 18 years of teaching experience and currently teaches in the third grade. Her favorite motivation in teaching is building relationships with her students and their families. She loves watching her students grow not only academically, but socially and emotionally. She loves watching them gain confidence and them having pride in all that they do. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is to spend more time with her family, and she loves reading books and sitting outside in the summer as much as she can. She takes lots of walks and goes on early morning runs, and she loves recharging over the summer, so she's ready to go for another great school year. Jack said he chose Mrs. Burst because she was always really nice to me, and she helped me get through the harder things in third grade. She was very helpful and showed me that she cared about me. I really loved being in her class. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Burson. Next, we have Hannah Cox from Klondike Elementary, who was selected by Cameron Miller to be here tonight. Mrs. Cox has 10 years of teaching experience and currently teaches in third grade. Her favorite thing and motivation in teaching is making connections with students and getting to know them as people, then using that connection to help them understand their own potential in learning and in life. Mrs. Cox received the Jackson Elementary Teacher of the Year Runner-Up Award in 2019. Her favorite thing to do in the summer is to spend time with family, friends, and camping, and this summer specifically welcoming Baby Cox. Cameron said he chose Mrs. Cox because she's been a great teacher and is super funny in class. She helped me learn and grow in third grade. Please put your hands together for Mrs. Cox. Next, we have Mrs. Slater from Klondike Elementary, who is selected by Brian Slater to be here tonight. Unfortunately, Mrs. Slater is not on vacation, or she is on vacation in Michigan, so Brian wanted to have his mom, Lindsay, recognized. Lindsay's been a mom of 11 years, having her patients pushed and tested by Bryant for nine of them. Lindsay loves to spend her time either shopping, talking about Disney, or crafting in her craft room. Bryant said he chose his mom because she always pushes me to do my homework and takes time to read books with me. Please put your hands together for Lindsay Slater. And last but certainly not least, we have Marty Myers from Vinton Elementary, who is selected by Coach Tim Myers to be here tonight. <laughs> Mrs. Myers has 24 years of teaching experience and currently teaches kindergarten. Her favorite thing and motivation in teaching is to teach life skills and to teach her students how to respect and love each other. She does this by showing them love, giving them many hugs, having patience with all teachers need, and giving her heart in all that she does for her students. Mrs. Myers is a Golden Apple recipient. Her favorite thing to do in the summer, which she doesn't get to do often because of baseball, is have coffee in the mornings in her sunroom, do crafts, and try to convince her husband to go to Disney World and the Magic Kingdom as much as possible. Coach Myers said he picked Mrs. Myers because she packs a mean cooler and snack bag for baseball tournaments. She always reminds him to play nice with others, she forgives him when he makes mistakes, and most of all, she loves and supports her family in this game of baseball, even though it can be overwhelming at times and a bit crazy. Please put your hands together for Marty Myers. One more round.